welcome back to my channel and thank you for watching this is beautiful keswick reach lodge retreat which is in the uk lake district national park i have stayed here many times we absolutely love the place we stayed in the uverdale a uh, two-bedroom dog friendly lodge um and my son and his girlfriend stayed in a premier select um whirlpool i think it's called but you will see all this coming up um the first day we arrived it was beautiful no rain and we managed to get snow while we were there after the first night which was absolutely beautiful you'll be able to see this coming up so this is our cabin which was really really nice that was little flo yeah. coming to say hello <laughs> so each bedroom has an ensuite there is a little walk-in wardrobe in the main bedroom the bathroom like i say towels provided little toilet miniature miniature toiletries provided um brilliant there's lights everywhere the kitchen is amazing all utensils salt and pepper provided there's a washer dryer there is a dishwasher there's kettle they give you a few little tea bags and coffee to start you off and this is the views outside our lodge which were amazing but wait till you see it when it starts snowing it's so beautiful little balcony um table and chairs and that is the view which is superb <laughs> up to the main reception area this is where you come when you arrive to check in and pick up your keys and they give you a lovely little keepsake tin with your key in which you can take home so as you can see there's the bar there's the check-in area with the little tins there's a tiny little shop which has essentials quite expensive but it is a handy that's the bar and restaurant you can take dogs into the bar in this area here and you can eat also there. There's the little tins, reception, shop. It's really cute, the corner shop. Jams, little leaflets. There's the spa offers, which I did try, which was amazing. This is coming outside now. I'll just walk them down towards our cabin. We should be coming up to a little dog wash just on the left round here now. See? Yes, there's the dog wash. And then there is a bike wash. Laundry area for staff. And this is the beginning of the park. There is the barriers for your car. They take your registration when you arrive and this will let you in and out the park.
So this is what happened when we woke up. It was snowing. We didn't expect snow at all. Woke up and this is what we got, which was absolutely amazing. And it stayed for the whole week while we were there. We stayed Saturday to Saturday, so the Monday to Friday is really quiet, especially with it being January. You do see, feel like you have the place to yourself the Monday to Friday. It's the weekend that it gets quite busy. I think a lot of people do Friday to Sunday or Friday to Monday. And we've seen lots of birds. Coming up now is the little robins, which I became obsessed with. I ended up going out and buying little bird food for them. We got all kinds, finches. I don't even know half the birds, but it was so nice watching them, the little robins. So cute. All different birds came every morning. How cute. <laughs> so coming up now is my son and his girlfriend's lodge which is the Warpool Premier Select which is absolutely beautiful hot tub this isn't dog friendly um, premium view so you're right on the lake and the view was amazing I put a little mini video together here we go to see what it's like As you can see their cabin was absolutely spectacular beautiful lake views really really nice um what can i say about this place so we booked with ho seasons i always book with ho seasons as i get 10 percent nhs discount but it is owned by derwin escapes you can also go on their website i went to the spa for the first time and had a back massage you have to pre-book this when you arrive because it gets really really busy is some views of over the lake, some beautiful pictures. The food, my son and his girlfriend went for a meal, said it was lovely. They do cocktails. We met them after the meal and had a little drink in the bar with the dog, which was great. Like I say, it's dog friendly. You do have to book for your meals also. Uh, any questions, please get in touch with me. I don't mind answering as, like I say, I've stayed here, it must be around 10 times and it is so nice it's i can't remember how long it's been open it must be about seven or eight years because we've been it feels, feels like we've been coming that long but look at these views and it's about a 10 minute drive into keswick center there's not much around there's a lot of places you can walk the dog around um the cabin area but there's nothing in walking distance really as in pubs apart from the on-site stuff which is available it's worth mentioning also, we do an online shop and get it delivered. They bring it to the reception area. So we just get our shop orders the week before we come and get it delivered on the day about four or five. Well, you can't check in till four o'clock. So we get it delivered five or just a bit later than five. I think it's Asda, Sainsbury's and Tesco who deliver in this area. Uh, so thanks for watching guys it's been great and please subscribe i have plenty more coming up in 2023 i will have more uk breaks i am going to turkey lara beach i am going to florida later in the year and i'm sure i'll have much more plans i'm thinking of visiting italy again um but i don't know yet i don't know what what's going on yet i need to sort out so I've, I want to go everywhere, but you can obviously only go where you can go and you can only get so much time off work. But thanks for watching and please subscribe. Bye.